I'm Tobias Bieberger. I'm the product manager for sports cars at Nissan Motor GB. We're here at the Innovation Station at the O2. This is the wildcard event for the GT Academy 2011. This is an opportunity for the gamers out there to win a ticket to the final round at the UK final, which will happen in May. I've come to the O2 to have a go at Gran Turismo, uh, try and get through to become a racing driver. Obviously guys like me would love to be a racing car driver and this gives people like me an opportunity to do it, so it's fantastic, it really is good. I wish I'd ever heard about it before today, I really do. I've got PlayStation at home actually, so I'll have a little go in a minute because I am registered here today. My wild card's here. So I think it's be a good opportunity to see if we've got any other females out there who can come in and and kick some ass on the track. I think people are really enjoying themselves here. So they are, we have uh, people from all over the place in the UK. They are really professional in that sense, so they are really hardcore gamers. So I think a lot of them have already tried uh, and put their numbers into the time trials. What's really coming down here is the creme de la creme who don't want to miss their chance to make it to the last final round uh, in the national finals. I kind of came down here in the hope uh, maybe I could uh, set a good time here. It's a popular game. There's uh, a lot of players who are really, really good at this, so uh, anything near the top is quite good. I think it's brilliant. Get a chance to get the, from the gamers to a real dream comes true. Uh, I just keep practicing and practicing. There are a lot of fast players out there, but I will try my best. All the players here, they love cars. They like playing games. It's, it's just nice to meeting people who love cars. From a Nissan perspective, this is a really interesting project because we started in 2008 and the winner from that time, uh, Lucas Odones, has made a fantastic career. So he has gone from virtual racing to reality. He's driving this year in the Le Mans 24 hour race. The whole project of GT Academy is also about accessibility, that people have this chance of, of, of doing something extraordinary and that fits nicely in with our traitors approach. I'm a few tenths off the top time, but I'm second at the moment, so I hope I can improve on that and uh, maybe uh, get the top spot. Yeah, I'm really disappointed because I did really bad. At the moment I'm third on the leaderboard, uh, and that is with a spin. If I do get anywhere, it will be a miracle. So who's in the lead now? It is now. At the moment, it's not by much though. But I will try again. Yeah.